Hey guys, my Hulk here, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're continuing the Let's Play series of SnowRunner with uh, part 10. Uh, on the last episode, we ended up doing a bit of exploration, getting to a couple of uh, watchtowers, found quite a few more sort of contracts and challenges and stuff for us to do. Uh, but on today's episode, we are going to complete one of the contracts for the town uh, where we basically have to just take it, certain supplies, I can't remember the actual name of the contract, uh, and we will also try to do the wooden bridge challenge where we just have to take some planks up to a bridge that needs to be constructed. Alright, so let's get started. Um, if you do enjoy the video, please hit the like button, um, and of course if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel as this helps me out a lot. Alright, so I'll give you a quick rundown of what we're going to do. So, our main thing uh, contract that we're going to do is for the Steel River Township. We're going to do Steel River Supplies. That's the name. I couldn't remember. So basically, have to deliver stuff to the town storage. So we've got the uh, fuel carry trailer, which we can't get to because it's going to be a long way. So the first thing we're going to do is basically drive from where we are up here all the way down along here, get up to the town, and then go for this watchtower. Uh, once we've got that done, that should hopefully give us a bit of a view onto the road here, uh, which we will need for later on. Uh, the next thing we'll do is take our fleet star from here, stop by the fountain, grab the consumables that we need, then swing past the lumber mill, grab some wood, and take both of those supplies to the town storage. Uh, depending on how long that takes, if we do have uh, some more time, we will go back, grab some lumber, take it to the wooden bridge here, build the wooden bridge, which will then allow us to go and grab this trailer and then take the trailer back there. So that will be the goal of this part and maybe into the next part. We'll see how we go. All right, so I will mark out our route for us to get going. So we want to sort of come across there, go past there. Ooh, that's going to be a problem. Alright, so we might, because we're not going to make it, we might cut through um, the farm, because I did not think, yeah, that power line has fallen. So that's going to pose a slight problem. Get up there, go up to the town, straight through the middle of the town, up to there, and then somehow up to there. We will try to get there as fast as we possibly can. We have no time to waste. So, this truck will not look as pretty by the time we get there, I feel. Um, hopefully, we don't get stuck going through the, uh, the farm. I feel that's probably going to be really the, the worst place for us to sort of have trouble in terms of getting stuck and, and wasting time. Everywhere else should be pretty good, I reckon. Um, but actually going through the farm isn't too bad because it'll help us unveil a bit more of the map. We might also stop for fuel at that uh, fuel station closer to the town. See how it does that weird jerky movement? Uh, we haven't quite made it to that yet. Cool. Alright. Back onto the road. Should be able to pick up a bit of speed here. Don't do with a slightly powerful engine. See, it handles much better on uh, the dirt. Once you sort of get onto the tarmac, it's not as nice of a ride. Yeah, so we'll probably come around this corner, lose control, and die. We definitely do not want to get stuck, as that will waste a lot of time. So, we'll do our best. Alright, into the farm. I'm pretty sure this is where we just go. Ooh, nope. No, because that's right, we can't. Might be able to go on it. We'll go to the town. That's how I marked it out. That's where we should go. Gotta remember, I made the waypoints for a reason. I should really follow them. Alright, what does that say? Garage. Yep, don't want to go there. Alright, now we're definitely cutting. This is going to be interesting. Will we make it across? Yes. Awesome. Try to make it across there. I do want to find out, can you actually break um, the fence here? 
can. Awesome. We will remember that for later when we go to try to get that truck. That, uh, if any of you remember, it was stuck in the mud just over to our right. As we go past it, I'll point it out again. And uh, it looks like we might be able to sort of take a shortcut to get to it, but we'd have to go through a fence. Um, that's where, yeah, so that truck right there that you can see, we would sort of sneak on the other side of this railing. We might be able to use a We'll go across there, get some speed up, sort of, yeah, do something to get there. But, yeah, get it from on the mud there, try to avoid the water as much as possible, because that's where we'll get bogged. Definitely takes forever to get across the map. Once that bridge is in, that wooden bridge should be a bit better off. Um, I do try to keep these videos sort of short, you know, I've seen there is some other Let's Plays of this game in particular that are like 45, 50 minutes long, and I don't know about most people, but I hate sitting there watching a video for 50 minutes. It's just too long, and then if you've got to stop it and come back later and watch it and find where you were, I'd rather, you know, have the same content split up over three videos, than you just watch the next one. So, or like in the last one, if you're a bit bored of exploration, that's pretty much all it was. You can skip that, just come straight to the next video. So, um, yeah. Um, I do actually end up playing these sort of three parts, each three or four parts each time I play. So, and then just sort of stop and cut it in between once we sort of achieve something. So the last part, I literally just was playing two, three minutes ago. But um, yeah, I just prefer to have it split up. And that is the behind the scenes episode. Holy shit. Okay. That uh, river was definitely stronger than I thought. Uh, fill up, just driving to like the pump below the whole petrol station up. The town would not be happy. 55 miles an hour. I don't think we've gotten close to 55 miles an hour this entire Let's Play series. Uh, cut through the town. Even I am the hero of Michigan. There is no one here. For whatever reason, that hotel reminds me of the motel in Bates Motel, the TV show, which I have not finished. Yeah, I still get Far Cry vibes. I reckon that's what they base this town off of. It has to be. Just looks too much like it. What that is. Black slide. Cool. Problem for another day. Another trail park. Lovely little lake to get eaten by a crocodile. Well, it looks like where we can get the contract to save a vehicle. What does that sign say? It's an art drawing site. Jeez, bad eyes. Well, that's actually a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. Okay. This mud will be interesting to get uh, the Fleet Star across with supplies. But we'll uh, do our best. As long as we sort of stick near some trees, we should be able to pull ourselves out if we do get in trouble. Alright, watchtower. Cool. We will have a really quick look at what we have discovered. So, yeah, it looks like quite a few things. Oh, okay. That bridge is a lot further than I thought it was going to be. Okay, so we're going to have to like continue up that road all the way around here and then back down. Because I don't think cutting across there is going to be much of an option. Interesting. Alright. Cool. We will not bother reading them. We will leave our truck there. We'll go back to the garage. Oh, wrong button. Garage. And we want this one. We will leave the garage. And we are basically going to the farm to grab consumables. 
and then to the lumber mill. Oh, and then should probably add that in to the town centre. I will start the contract as well. Activate. Sweet. Wow. Only if they wanted metal beams. You can buy trailers from here, but um, I think the ones that you find around the place are good enough. All right. I don't know how we check what level we are. Ah, oh, there we go. We are level three. All right. Vehicles opened. Eight. That's it. Really? Okay. That many vehicles, unless that's just for Michigan. So I mean, there's a few vehicles lying around here and there. You can't tell me that's the entire game's vehicles are in Michigan. It's like f f seven or eight other maps. There's quite a few, a few other places we're gonna go. I think after we get some of this money, we might look at. Um, oh, we got the up no, the upgrades are usually free, but yeah, after this we might look at getting just some sort of cosmetic things for this truck. Um, making it look a bit better. So we need two consumables. So I guess it's grain and uh, stuff like that. Definitely not cow. There is no meat. This uh, miserable farm anyway. Alright. Perfect. Let's go. That definitely took a lot longer getting up to that watchtower than I had hoped. Ooh, I wonder if that fence will reset now that we've destroyed it. Oh, turn. Definitely getting close. Our trailer is still there, which is good. It does seem to save stuff where you left it, which I like. drive on. Seems to sort of make the vehicles go a bit quicker. Could be wrong, but it just feels that way. Get to the town, they needed food. Obviously they're very hungry, and then wood. Then we'll go for the uh, fuel trailer. Fuel carrier trailer, I wonder if it's, it's got a big tank on it. Serious? Not that heavy. Come on. Kind of get the feeling we're not doing all of this in one mission. Not with how far away that wooden bridge was. We might, uh. Ooh, dear. Break it up into two parts, I reckon. I'd like to keep around the 15 minute mark if I can. Try not to go over 20, that's sort of like my max. But, um, yeah, we're getting on there, so we're just looking at the timer now. Depending on how many cuts I take out. We're at, well, it's reading 14 minutes. So, yeah, 14 minutes. So, it's probably 12 time. I take out a few times and I probably pause to check where we're going, stuff like that. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have time to build the bridge. <laughs> and I'm going to turn there. Probably should have marked that out. Ooh, that means we're going to go up that big hill. Interesting. Hmm. Hopefully we make it. I suppose this vehicle is pretty good. Like, it does have its diff locks and stuff. Ooh. Well, if you did have to pay for your damage, sort of, you'd, you'd find you'd drive a bit more cautious, I guess. But um, it does not help when you're trying to get somewhere in a rush. I wish you could find out like what the upgrades were. That would be very nice. Come on, little truck. You got this bouncing around all over the place. The driver's like probably smacked it on the roof like 30 times already. 
not be a comfortable ride. Especially not trying to go this fast as look at it. Whatever we are carrying has probably turned into a milkshake by now. Ah, I want to go the other way. I forgot the trail. Oh, did I still have trails that good? I swear we took that trailer for something else. We, oh, did we use it? No, we thought about using it for the uh, time trial. Uh, oh. This is going to be interesting. Who puts a trailer there? At least we got that pole when we get us out if we need to. It's such a stupid place. Really? I sort of knew it was here. Uh, touch track. Right. Awesome. Let's get to the town. Yeah, if this was raised, that would help a lot. I wish I could be just be on the raised um, upgrade. It's like across the board. And I bet there's probably a lot of upgrades for this in Alaska. So, but we've still got a lot of work in Michigan to do before we even think about going to Alaska. Probably should just go to Alaska. There's probably heaps of stuff that we need to make the game a lot easier, but. Finish off one place at a time. Ooh, yep. Uh, low range and diff lock. There we go, that should get us up. That diff lock has definitely saved us. I don't think we would have made it up here otherwise. Yeah, I think we're probably going to cut the video once we deliver this and uh, we'll pick it up again uh, for the uh, next part afterwards. So I am going to be releasing these much more frequently seeing as I am doing so many so often I'll probably definitely keep doing a couple releases at a time. Um, at the moment I sort of schedule stuff for, you know, a new video each day with that between this and the IL2 thing over but if I'm recording sort of three parts at a time or something, I might as well put out a couple of the videos. Especially since then I'll start building up, I'll end up being sort of weeks in front and it's a bit stupid. Sort of, maybe on a couple of days. Don't always get the chance to play. Alright. Made it up that hill. I'm quite surprised. I thought we were going to get stuck, but uh, we didn't. I wonder if they'll take the trailer from us. I know we're actually going to go back and get wood again just to get across that bridge. Damn, it's a shame we couldn't take a trailer and take two trailers. All we should have done is just come on straight here and then got the wood. Wow, that's still just as much backtracking, I suppose. Now, around the back. I wonder what that big box is on the back of that uh, trailer. Alright, unload and. Unload. Alright, now let's. Ditch this trailer with the park brake off. Probably might take it around. I'm gonna try to put it near that other trailer. Get it a little bit out of the way. Ooh, she's uh, sliding a bit. Let's see how perfect we can get it lined up. I'm gonna have these trailers everywhere. Back a little. Oh, it really takes off. It's like there's no. It's little, there we go. Alright, uh, um, nope. Detached trailer. Awesome. Alright, we will sleep in our truck here tonight and uh, 
yeah, we'll finish the video there. So if you did enjoy it, please leave a like. Um, of course, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. And until next time, thanks for watching.